So it's been a while the Galaxy Note 20 news is finally back this is something that is quite unexpected we have some brand new information regarding the camera specification for the first time about from the main 180 maybe so lens we didn't know what Samsung will do with the other lens education and now I see words has spilled the bins with some latest information and based on this new information I think it's safe to say that the 100x Hume is definitely dad so the main center of the Galaxy Note 20 plus is the same one as the yesterday Ultra 6008 megapixel and one 1 by 1.33 and sensor still one of the biggest sensors in the game that we had a brand new periscope sensor this is the 13 maybe so 3 and 5 1 by 2.4 inches sensor this periscope sensor is utilizing the eyes are so slim 3 and 5 actually have a sport page for this on Samsung semiconductor website this sensor has some good features such as the 120 FPS video recording along with wider dynamic range for this new sensor sensing is set to achieve a maximum zoom off of 50 times 50 x is still a lot of zoom if you want to assume that far but the best results will come at 5x hume level or at 10x as we have seen with the galaxy is 20 ultra the 10x hume is actually really really good because of the marketing of 100x that points kinda get neglected this time sensing is making the right decision now as for the underwriting unless we have a brother pixel jewel 3 1 by 2.55 and sensor the sensor also has some really really good specs going on such as the 1000 fps long overdue recording at 720b dual pixel autofocus wider dynamic range in my personal testing the ultra wide angle lens and sensing flexion phones are one of the best out there with great detail and great dynamic range along with the 100x hume sensing will also be ditching the time of flight sensor which was kind of a waste in my opinion i've seen samsung phones with note the us sensor is still able to do great job Job with portrait images and I know there could be some limitations to the 3D or stuff but right now what we need is a better super quick autofocus system instead of the time of flight sensors Samsung is using a brand new laser autofocus system for the Note 20 plus camera that will have the 108 Marcel M1 to perform at its absolute best hopefully this will improve the images at close distance as well as the video autofocus performance which we have seen on the yesterday ultra that it suffers a lot I still think that the M1 sensor of the Galaxy is 20 the Ultra is really really powerful and combined with the good hardware and the right software execution Samsung can do wonders also in the news we have some brand new information on the battery capacity of the Galaxy Note 20 according to the listing found in the Chinese certification database we have the battery size of 4300 million power for the Galaxy Note 20 this is the same battery size of the Note and plus from last year's letter surprising because last time we heard that the Note 20 will have 4,000 million battery but it's actually a bit bigger than that according to this latest leak that the decision to have a bigger battery of the base Galaxy Note 20 model could be because of the 120 is display and the 5G connectivity I hope that is true because all the Galaxy is pretty models have 120 her screen so it makes sense for all the Note 20 phones to have 120 or screen as well I believe the 4300 labor battery for a 6.4 inch 120 Hertz display is a pretty good deal regarding the Galaxy Note 20 Plus we have a 4500 million power which I believe is a little less it should have been 5000 but since is coming with LDP or refresh rate and the rumored Exodus 992 which is coming with a 5 nanometers process I think this is a pretty power efficient combo which is why Samsung is probably taking the chance of putting the 4500 MSL the Note 20 Plus and not making it do think making the device still pretty sleek despite having a full-on S10 also there's a new division coming from Bluetooth certification in all of SM and 986U has been spotted and the name is mentioned as Galaxy Note 20 Ultra this led to the speculation that Galaxy Note 20 Ultra might happen but then again it's three Galaxy Note 20 models I don't think Samsung will pull that off there's a good chance that the Bluetooth certification could be wrong about the name because last under effort the model numbers as Galaxy is 11 but the ended up as as 20 so you still see this as the Galaxy Note 20 Plus and just have to note phones which in my opinion makes more sense because Ross Young also said that the Ultra model this year is going to be the Galaxy phone do anyways there's still a lot of news that we need to know regarding the Note 20 family that we will know in the future but here is what you will see on the camera of the Galaxy Note and the Plus let me know your thoughts about this the comments are below what you think about this decision. 
of ditching the 100x hume entirely you think samsung should have kept it and just not use the marketing please subscribe like the video comment thanks for watching see you on my next video one piece out